this morning we have an angel among us. Andy Senor Jr. played the beloved angel in the groundbreaking musical Rent, which earned four Tonys when it debuted back in 1996. Well, and Andy helped bring the show off Broadway, directing a production in Cuba. Now a new documentary, it's called Revolution Rent, takes us all behind the scenes of how he did it. Yeah, and to call it a challenge would be an understatement. Andy's Havana's production was the first Broadway musical performed in Cuba in more than 50 years. Take a look. Wow. Substitute America con Cuba. Cuba. Sí. Y cuando vives en Cuba, al final de este milenio, y cuando vives en Cuba, vendes tu alma por poder. Cuando vives en Cuba, al final de este milenio, ser es tener. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? No te tengo que preguntar, pero... Conexión. Emoción. Yeah, Andy joins us now from Barcelona. Andy, good morning. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, first of all, just congratulations on this film, on the production. You and I have a lot in common. We're both children of Cuban immigrants who grew up bilingual in Miami. And, I, you know, what did it mean to bring this to Cuba? Because as we see in the film, it was controversial even in your own family. You know, for me, it was uh, one of those moments in, in life where, Everything that I've ever done just meets at that point, and I feel like, wow, this is this is my purpose. This is this is why I'm here. Um, and it was a it was a, a spectacular uh, event in my life for sure. There's a clip where your family is telling you you're crazy. You know, yeah. a lot of people are telling you for cra you're crazy for doing this. So to put that in perspective, you shot this back in 2014. It was certainly a labor of love. And then Neil Patrick Harris jumped on as executive producer. And now it's on HBO. There's no question about it. You had so many challenges. What was it like for you to make it then to opening night? You know, if, it was hard because I... I wanted to make sure that we that the show was you know up to the to the greatest level, but we were working with actors that had never done a musical before. It was the first musical done in um, in Havana in 50 years by an American company. So I was working with actors that had never sung, singers who had never acted before, mm. and then with the technical. Um, the lack of technical resources uh, in Havana, it was it was. It was very difficult. So, you know, I have on one hand, I want to make sure that we get the best show possible. But on the other hand, I want to make sure that I don't dishonor my family in right. some way or that I'm getting myself involved in something that I shouldn't be getting myself involved in. So it was a risk on multiple levels uh, for me. So when we made it, you know, to opening night uh, and after uh, Obama made the normalization between the two countries, there was a huge sigh of relief that we had made it there. I, I have to ask, because I know you're in Barcelona working on other things, but during the pandemic, you put on a production of Rent in South Korea. I mean, nothing was happening during the pandemic. How did you make that work? Well, um, I kept on thinking, well, this is not going to happen. It's definitely not going to happen. And this was in April of 2020. Oh. So it was at the height of the pandemic. Um, but, you know, Korea uh, was so uh, advanced in in uh, how they were handling uh, the COVID situation. So, you know, they were they got me the visa. I had to do, you know, the typical quarantine and the tests and so forth. And then the rehearsal process was very, very, very rigorous as far as testing mm -hmm. and um, sanitary uh, uh, sanitary wise uh but yeah we pulled that one off as well <laughs> i kept on thinking it was like god this is a whole other documentary <laughs> I know, I know. hey andy really quickly uh 25 years since you played angel on broadway and in that time you've seen a, a, a real opening of diversity and talk about diversity on broadway how do you think it's changing um i think it's changing that like there, there's so many opportunities i remember when I was doing uh, Rent, I was looking around and I was, there was one particular moment where I was the only Hispanic in a leading role on Broadway. And um, now it's, that's just not the case anymore. There's so many opportunities. When I used to audition, I was, you know, the ethnic option. And now it's like, we only want ethnic people. It seems that way at least. But uh, yeah, it's, it's incredible how much, how much, uh, 
it's how much it's opened up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it has definitely changed. Well, Andy, thank you so much for making this film. Revolution Rent is available on HBO and HBO Max. If you love musicals, if you love Rent, if you want to learn more about Cuba and everything that's going on both here and over there, you should definitely check it out. That's I love it. Yeah. I get to learn <laughs> a little so much, something and, and enjoy it too. All right, thank you.